All right, so this is long chess. The knights are definitely gonna be super weak, so I don't know if I'm gonna get those going right away. Let's just go for a classic e4. He responds with e13. I think we can get our queen out early. I think that's pretty safe. I wanna push my pawns. I have to get all the way to the 16th rank to promote, so that might not be the best idea. Okay, d13. That opens up this bishop. Let's get our own bishop out. I think controlling as many squares as possible is gonna be the way to go for sure. He gets a knight out early. I'm not sure if he's just defending this pawn. Um, let's move our own knight. I think I wanna go here. So this pawn is undefended. Let's be careful about that. Okay, the bishop move, that's interesting. I don't really know what that does. Let's just castle. He castles as well. Okay, so he's just getting the bishop out of the way. Maybe we should attack this pawn. I don't know if that does much. Let's just push for now. It's not defended. I could go here. We should maybe get our own bishop out. I like the square. It's defended by the knight. I can get my queen out if it gets attacked at some point. Be worried about maybe this diagonal though. Okay, he pushes this pawn. He's probably going to get his rook involved. Let's move another knight. I'm going to try to get these rooks. At the very least, I'll push this pawn one more and maneuver the rook. They start looking to capture some of his pieces though. Again, this pawn is not defended, but I'm sure you could defend it really easily. So maybe that was the point of the move to defend this bishop, which is not attacking anything. So if I go here and then he doesn't capture, I'd have to capture. I wouldn't have to capture, but that wouldn't be good. Let's just push again. Okay, this pawn push. His bishop is now kind of locked in. I can't do much about it, but it's good to know he's kind of stuck as far as this bishop goes. Let's go with this rook move first. He pushes again. It's going to take so long for him to promote. I don't know if that's something he's going to want to do. So getting the rooks out is great and all. I might have to actually push the pawns because having all these pieces out with nothing defending them but the other minor pieces is maybe not the best. You might be asking why not just have promotion on the eighth rank. Well, it's long chess, baby. In all serious, no, I, I might add that as a an optional rule or something, but I don't know. It's just kind of fun. This pawn's still undefended. Let's get a little bit aggressive. This pawn now also undefended. So I can get to this square safely, then I win a pawn. Let's start trying. So this next move... Oh, this already threatens the pawn, so he'll see that coming. Okay, so now I can go here, threaten this pawn as well. It's kind of an empty threat, though. I could go here, then he can push, and that's defended. Let's just get this rook involved. Okay, let's just push some pawns, I guess. He's getting his knight, like, super far into the game. He's not defending anything. Let's keep pushing. He's doing that as well. Let's get our knight out of the way. Allow some more pawns to push. If these pawn pushes keep happening, we might just have a normal 8x8 eight eight game with just a bunch of extra squares in the back. He has a much more neat structure. I don't know if that's going to come back to bite me, but oh well. This pawn's still defended. This bishop's not defended. I think that's his only undefended piece, except for... No, the rook's defended. Let's push. When in doubt. Another knight move. So now I could... Okay, let's pin it. Now the knight's pinned. It is defended twice. Okay, so he unpins it right away. So let's push another pawn. Okay, oh, a fork. Um, it's fine. Might see the first capture of the game, though. What's the best square for this? Slide back here. That should be safe. Okay, so the knight, yeah, that's probably a good trade for him. Because the bishop has a lot more mobility. Yeah, okay. Not the best for me. Uh, okay, and this pawn, it's still defended, so that's fine. But I do have to get my queen out of the way. That doesn't do anything at all, so I probably shouldn't, but... Interesting that that's a possibility. Let's just get way out of the way. I think that's fine. It could be nice to... So this bishop's defending, but maybe some kind of sneaky mate if this bishop moves. Okay, now he's staring down my bishop. I think that's fine. And he also blocks off. I don't know what he wants to do with that. Well, let's let it happen. If he wants to take it, I'll let him take it. Queen coming out now. He might be trying to go for the same thing I'm going for, but I don't have to be worried about any pawns taking my bishop, so I'm going to do the same thing he did and just lock my bishop in. Okay, so now this, okay, so that attacks my queen. Not a big deal. Let's just, let's just go here. This bishop won't be going anywhere anytime soon. My next goal probably to push here. Okay, under attack again. Ah, uh, interesting. I think I have to attack the queen because this pawn, only defended by the bishop, it could get overworked. Oh no, okay. I can defend? Oh, the knight's, the knight's defended anyways. That's not a big deal. So I have to keep this under control here. I can attack it. He can't really take anything. Let's just attack it. Okay, back to this square. This could attack it too, but I don't know if I like that. Let's go for it. It's pretty safe. Spawn still defended twice, actually. I could just push to defend it again. Okay, I think we can just go here. Not a big deal. Oh, it's offering a trade, actually. Do I want to take that? Takes, takes... I could also take the rook right away. I kind of like that. I don't think he can do anything to stop it. Let's go for it. it takes the bishop, so now takes, takes. Or I could even get another pawn out of it. Which pawn do I want? Let's go here and then take. So up a pawn and we have, I have two rooks, he has one, I have two knights, and he has two bishops and a knight for one pawn. I don't even know if I'm better by much, if at all. Also not doing great on time, but it should be fine. Let's get this rook involved, make use of our extra pieces. Could also check him, but that doesn't really do anything. 
Let's back it up. So we can attack this now. I'll be forced to go probably here. It's defended, so I don't really have to. Let's go here before he even has a chance to go here. It does give him this file, but I'm kind of fine with that. I can attack this bishop next, especially if he pushes his pawn. Well, you'd have to push it quite a bit. Okay, that doesn't work anyways. Let's push. We're kind of not doing great on time. Oh, what does this do? Oh, it's check. Okay. Let's just get over here. You can attack it next move. Get it just out of my zone. We have to start making moves pretty quickly, though. Under two minutes. Okay. We can go here. Attacks the bishop. And then... Oh, I actually wasn't looking at this diagonal. That was really close to a blunder. But the idea now is to move all the way over here. Once he gets out of the way. Oh, that's not good. Oh, no, that's fine. Let's go here. I think I'm safe. He can go here. Actually, he can't. Because I can take. But this knight's still defended. Now he attacks this... Do I have to be worried about this move? This is still defended. I'll just go here. So the pawn's still defended, except for maybe if he takes this. He does. Let's actually, we can just take this now. I think we're safe to do that. Pawn's under threat. Let's just push. Pretty much everything's on light squares, so this bishop's kind of useless. Let's match his push. Ooh, okay. Double attack. Okay, so let's take the free pawn. You could also... Actually, I didn't realize that this move forces a trade. So since we're on material, I think we can do that. He pushes. This is a check now, but I don't know if it does much. I could maybe get this here and then swing this rook in. That could be checkmate, which I probably should be going for. But let's just get this trade. Okay, so now I'm going to want to push these pawns. So I have one pawn that hasn't pushed at all. Okay, so let's, look at, let's get this going. What does this move do now? Ah, he's going to be behind here. We can... Yeah, this is fine. Oh, it's blunder, actually. Let's take it. So now we... Don't have to worry about diagonals, just the knight. This is the most bizarre pawn chain I've ever seen. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Okay, let's keep let's keep growing the pawn chain if we can. Oh, does this move do anything? I don't think so. He's not attacking anything yet. Let's get our king moving. He can, oh, he could have won a pawn. No, it's defended. We're good. So I want to push this again. I'm going to put rook and two pawns, which I'm happy with. Let's keep it going. Okay, now he's going to be able to threaten something. Let's get way out of the way. Still defended. And my goal is going to be to get over here. Okay, he doesn't let that happen. Keep pushing. Okay, so now let's just keep growing our pawn chain. We'll have to move our knight. We don't even have to. Let's go here. Is this actually... No, it won't be too close to... Wait, if we can get our knight here, how do we do that? Okay, let's go here. So then here, here. And then if I can get my rook here... Okay, he doesn't let me do that. Let's push. I might want to get this knight out. I really want to get this checkmate. It's not going to work if he moves like any of his pawns, really. But okay, he's defending that. Let's go here. Interesting. Okay, let's try to set this up now. So what we need to do, knight here, rook here, then pawn here. I think that's checkmate. Let's go for this first. Ah, I blundered the pawn. There goes that entire plan. So now, what to do? This pawn's undefended, running very low on time. Let's go here so we can push this pawn. The king could get in here, which I don't like. That's what he looks like he's trying to do. Let's get our king in. We're just gonna have to move out of the way. He, okay, that's fine. What's he going for now? Just push. Okay, push again. Uh, that might have been a mistake. Maybe get this king in first. Okay. So let's just push. So now, what? We have this, this. This square is the only one that wouldn't be defended. This check wouldn't even really be that close to mate. Let's threaten this pawn. Now this one's undefended. So if he pushes here, then... Okay, he doesn't. This should win the pawn, I think. Okay, he checks me. Let's go here so we can't get checked again. Okay, let's take... Comes with check. We can go here. Is this checkmate? Yeah, it says capture because it's technically chess versus checkers, but we got it. Okay, that was miserable. Long chess is a horrible idea and nobody should ever do it. <laughs> okay, so now it's my turn to play with black. He goes, he's gonna get his rook out really early. Okay, let's do the same thing we did last time. Okay, so I think he, he's learned from last game. Let's, let's just go here. This uh, kind of blocks our bishop in, which isn't great, but we can get this bishop in now. Actually, what this allows us to do is maybe this with the bishop, play a little bit more safe. So he wants to get his queen out, it looks like goes to that square which is not defended so let's push real quick work on this square now that's fine unless he brings his queen in then we'll have to probably push it a couple we could even do that right now or block with the bishop let's do that okay this bishop move now he can go here and it's defended let's try to stop that from happening go here now this pawn's kind of weak he takes and now what oh i see well oh no so we can take the wow that's really interesting actually he'll be able to take this pawn because actually i think that is okay so now the idea takes, and I can't take back because you can take this with check. And if I move up, I think I'm still fine. That's not too bad. Oh, he goes in here right away. Oh, interesting. Wow. I can go here. Does that save everything? I think this move works. I think everything's still defended. Okay, he just backs out. 
this pawn now is, is not doing too great. I can push the knight to stop that. Let's do that. Now I might want a castle. Okay, so now this pawn's not defended. It will stop me from castle. I can just move up to defend this though. And now this pawn is attacked twice again. And I'm, okay, so that is probably a good move for him. Okay, so I think he's gonna win that pawn, which kind of sucks, but that's okay. Let's go here. That way he's forced to take with bishop. Okay, so now we can castle safely. Does that work? I'll leave our rook here. Yeah, that's fine. So we can actually maybe, the bishop's kind of stopping us from doing it, but if we attack the bishop, could win it. Okay, so now this is attacked. Um, He's still defending the bishop. I think that's all he wanted to do there. Oh, that's a horrible move. That would pin. Okay, I think this is the move right here with the knight. Let's go for it. This square potentially under threat. Okay, he's attacking that pawn. Just push it. What can he do now? So that doesn't work, but it almost does. I could simply push. Also, I just realized that if he does this, that completely blunders a bishop. So you can push this pawn. Oh, nope. <laughs> that allows the same pin that I do not want. I can, at the very least, if he goes here, now I can block with the knight. Does that make it worth going for? Probably not. Let's go for it. Whatever. Could have gone here too. Actually, that probably would have been a much better move because now my knight's pinned to my queen. I can attack and defend at the same time. I might be forced to do that if he now slides this down. He does. Let's go. We have two options. Let's go for this one. Let's get his rook in now. Let's try to get this bishop out of the way. Oh, okay. Is that a problem? You could do a little Greek gift, I guess. Not really. Not at all a Greek gift, but we're not pinned anymore. But if we do something like this, actually, we couldn't even get pinned again because it's defended now. So let's try to kick, keep kicking him out. So if he goes here, he can't even... He does it. Okay. So he's going to get that back now. Oh, it's check. That's fine, I think. We can go here. Oh, but that's going to be a pin. So we can't do that first. What to do? Do we have other options? I think we're kind of forced to do this. And that just buys us a little bit of time. Let's do it. So now this move, and then I defend with pawn, and I think we survive. And then maybe we can force the queen out. So let's see here. Then he can maybe even take. No, that doesn't work. He goes here with check. Now can we block? Oh, but that wins the rook. Are we forced to give up the rook? No. Is this okay? Does this work? I can't tell if I'm just getting checkmated. Okay. Yeah, now I think we just want to get rid of this queen as fast as humanly possible. He did push this pawn. So what? Maybe something like that. He doesn't leave. Yeah, so he definitely wants to do something like this. Well, it, he can't quite do that. He'd have to go here. Now he could actually bring his bishop because defended. That's okay. So if we move this knight, now our bishop defends this rook. He goes for this. I can... So the problem with this is that... Takes, takes, takes. Here, um... The only reason it would work... Wait. Takes. Well, actually, takes. Then I can't take back because I lose here. Actually, it's defended, so that's fine. Let's double our rooks up. I think we can do that safely. What? He comes in here. I can just take. So he'd have to... I don't even know where he could go with his bishop. Okay, so he just attacks this rook now. We can counterattack, and I think that's fine. Okay, so he slides back... Now my rook's just under attack. Can maybe attack the bishop first. He doesn't have a light square bishop. Let's do that. This square would be nice to get to. They're both at about two minutes now. This is going to get kind of interesting. That's a check. Does that do much? Do I have to be worried about this? Is this move fine? I think so. Does he have a plan? The bishop's hanging. You go here safely. You could just stay where he is. Maybe get this rook in somehow. No, he goes here. Very interesting. So I can't take this anymore, but I can still... What? What could I do? This move is interesting. It doesn't even drop a pawn. Okay, let's do it. Be very careful about this knight. He can maybe take advantage of that. He could go here or here. Just capturing would lose me the queen. Okay, clock's winding down. I think it would kind of be a waste to push my pawns. Let's try to get our queen in the game, actually. Let's do this. He could go right back here. Uh, and then what do I do? I'm not sure. He attacks it. It's defended, so I kind of have to leave. But do I have to? I could go here. So he has this, this... That doesn't work. We're both out of minutes. This is officially a bullet game. He wants to get in here, maybe. So here, here is checkmate. No, it's not checkmate. Here, here would be. So that starts with this move. Can I stop that? I can't stop that very easily. 30 seconds, 20. Okay, I have to do this. Threatens the bishop too, so that's fine. So you have to slide back up here with the queen to save it, I think. And what do we do? Okay, just moves out of the way. Just attack. Move up, stay off of the... Okay, so he wins that pawn. That's not great. Forces the queen trade. I hope that's all he does. I think that's all he's doing. No, he moves up again. I can block. That does nothing. Let's go here. Then what? Check again. Force down. That can't be a mating pattern, right? Oh, I can go up instead. It's probably not great. Let's do it. 
I don't know. Oh, interesting. You can block with the knight now. Oh, is that checkmate right here? Ugh. Okay, I think that was forced me anyways. Well, GG. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Long chess is absolutely miserable to play. Maybe it's better with a longer time control, but anyways, if you want to try it for yourself, it's available as part of the beta for my game Deckmate. You have to be on the experimental version and then start a chess versus checkers game and use this console command, and then it'll just start a normal long chess game. So anyways, with that being said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see more, and I hope to see you in the next video.